me. And today we're gonna be watching a holiday special about a rich mom who shames a poor mom for her cheap presence. Let's watch. And so I told her, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> Five seconds into this, and we already know that she's a Karen. Fantastic! Oh, hi. I'm so sorry we're late. We missed the bus and everything, and anyhow, here are the cookies you asked me to bring. That's what you brought. They look so cheap. And where did you even buy those anyway? Uh, well, I didn't buy them. I... My son and I, we baked them. Homemade cookies! The best kind! What do you want her to do? Run over to the nearest Louis Vuitton and buy some monogram cookies? You asked for cookies and this is what you're getting! I baked and he decorated. First you show up at my Christmas party late and then you bring... those. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I bought these. Each one is handmade by an award-winning pastry chef. It looked like they just came from the Costco. They cost $10. Dang, that's a lot. I bet they still as crusty as her Karen cut. You can fight me, but nothing tastes better than homemade fresh cookies. Wow, those look delicious. <sighs> it's a good thing I didn't care on Jasmine and had a backup plan. How do you know her again? Her son and my son are friends, so I had to invite her. She's so rude, I was gonna say. Why did you even invite her? If you're just gonna treat her like garbage. Also, if you're so rich, why are you asking guests to bring food? I should arrive at the party and the food should already be there. That just makes you a bad host. All right, everyone, it's time for the white elephants. Let's start with number one. That's me. If you didn't know, a white elephant is where everybody brings a mystery gift and then everyone has to open a random gift. I'll take this one. Smart choice. That one's from me. A crystal ornament. Wow. Oh, thank you so much, Karen. Oh my goodness, of course her name is Karen. She even got the Karen cut. This is what happens when a Karen has too much money. It's Swarovski. Ooh. I know we said $25 limit, but come on, <laughs> who really followed that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, such a flex showing up with a $50 ornament. You couldn't have paid for all the kids' tuition or something? <laughs> Just kidding, you're not that kind of rich, Karen. Oh. I'm number two. I choose... Hmm. Oh, maybe choose another one? No. Uh, I already chose. Oh. She's asking for trouble at this Is point. Is this a handmade ornament? <laughs> it looks like it costs less than a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Why are y'all laughing? <laughs> Let me guess. This She's not even one funny. came from you. Yeah, my, my son and I, we painted it together. Uh, it reminded me of when- Where'd you get the materials? The 99 cent store? I cannot believe her right now. <laughs> Where did you get the materials for every little thing you're wearing? Sorry you don't spend time with your child doing activities. <laughs> if you don't like it, you, you could always uh, trade it for- uh... No. I don't want anyone else to get stuck with this. <laughs> Be like, no, I'm keeping it because I actually secretly like it. I wish me and my son painted together. Too bad he hates me. That's why Let's she's mad. To number three. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, really? So awesome. I would have just left. <laughs> Here you go, Richie. I hope one of these has what I asked for. Well, I know you're going to love them. I'm gonna open them right now. If there isn't a PS5 in here, I'm committing a crime. Also, why weren't they under the tree? What's wrong, Max? Didn't your mother get you any gifts? She just loves bullying! Wait a minute, before the next one, we're gonna go on a little adventure. So put on your hat. Ah. 
Where are we? Where are my glasses? Sorry, I've been playing too much of the Ants Underground Kingdom. It's the world's first ant and insect themed simulation strategy game. Only half a year after it launched, the game has been downloaded over 25 million times. And you can download it for free worldwide in the App Store and the Google Play Store. So if y'all ever wondered what it's like to be an ant, now you can. It sounds wild. I get to play as an ant and see the world through my bug eyes. Sign me up. There's so much freedom. You can explore the world as an ant. Custom design your own ant. Ant Hill. You can even DIY your very own in-game emoji. The graphics are amazing and the art style is very elegant and just makes the whole gameplay very smooth. The whole ant world just looks very beautiful and realistic. The scenes are also very unique, like I have never played anything like it. In the game there are real wild creatures and a bunch of different environments. There are hundreds of special ants and there is a whole gotcha system with so many different kinds of ants. Each special ant has its own talent and skills and you can cultivate them and build your very own powerful ant troop. I don't know what you're waiting for because it's time to foster the most powerful ant army and build your own dream ant kingdom. So click the link in the description below, download the Ants Underground Kingdom, use code WOLF for a bunch of free rewards. And on Christmas, even more rewards. I hope you like it. <laughs> Thanks, mom. <laughs> hey, this isn't a PS5. A, a picture frame? That's what you got him for Christmas? How cheap. Bro, what's cheap is your attitude. I know it's not much, honey, but I hope you like it. Like it? I love it. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. I'll put this next to my bed. child. Mine could never. I got my son a blue iPhone and he threw it at me and spit on me because it wasn't white. Max. That's where the trauma came from. You don't from. have to lie. You can tell her you hate it. I mean, what kind of a mother spends five dollars on their son's Christmas present? A mother that doesn't have a rich husband paying for everything, huh, Karen? Because you don't look like you work. She's doing everything she can to try to make her feel bad. Would you mind giving us a moment? Tell her off. No, I don't think you understand what the holidays are about. Yes, stupid. You see, I may not be able to afford fancy cookies from an award-winning chef, but my son and I put a lot of love into the cookies we made. And that is what matters. What is love? Can I bite into it? Can I taste it? Tastes like clumpy bacon soda. And I may not be able to buy expensive things for the white elephant exchange. But I put a lot of time into decorating that ornament with my son. And to me, that means a lot more. That is true. You're getting a gift made with love. I mean, whether you're getting the Swarovski crystal or the handmade ornament, it's gonna go in a box in a drawer somewhere and be forgotten. And I may not be able to afford a lot of Christmas presents for my son, but I teach him to be grateful for everything that he gets, no matter the cost. And that boy is grateful. And that matters more than anything. That is true. She's spitting facts. Now I wish she'd actually spit on Karen. So you see, the holidays are not about how much you spend. They are about how much love you give. I mean, yeah, it is about giving. Giving and not expecting anything back. <laughs> Too many Chardonnays. <laughs> All of you poor people are grateful, aren't you? That sounds like something a poor person would say. <laughs> you clearly have no idea what the holidays are about. Does she never grow out of her high school bully phase? Girl, you are grown. A mother and still acting like this. These cookies are so good. They're my favorite. Yeah, are there any more? <laughs> I'm so glad that you like them. I tell you what. I can make more and send them to you. Um, <laughs> did you try the ones that I bought over there? Yeah, they're those disgusting. <laughs> yeah, no one's eating those. I want more of these. <laughs> Nobody even liked the fancy award-winning cookies. Award-winning chefs put caviar on cardboard and rich people will still eat it. Excuse me, Karen? Do you still have that handmade ornament by chance? Yes. Why? 
Is it possible to trade you, actually? That one reminds me of my childhood. My mom used to make ones just like that for our tree. So you wanna trade this ornament for the fancy one that I bought from Swarovski? But then I'm just getting my gift back. You're you humiliating me at my own party. Handmade ornament than a crystal one? Yeah. Ugh. Whatever. Here. Thanks so much. So much attitude. I can't believe this. What's wrong, sweetheart? You didn't give me the new PS5. <gasps> <laughs> Figured since you had the PS4, you didn't need the 5. You've got all those other great gifts. I don't care about all the other stupid gifts. I wanted a PS5. Here it is! I wanted the PS5! How could you not give me a PS5? Well, you had the 4, so I thought close enough. Well, you thought wrong! Christmas about to get ruined! Sorry, honey. I will get you one as soon as I can. This is seriously the worst Christmas ever. <laughs> I hate you. <gasps> oh! I don't know how she could keep a straight face right now. I would have been on the floor laughing. Like, dang, you raised that? No wonder you're such a stinky person. Here's some advice. It's not about how much money you spend. It's about getting your kid a PS5. It's about how much love that you give. Nah, that child does not want love. It was nice to see you, Karen. He wants to play Warzone on Christmas against all the noobs. Thanks again, Mom. I love you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that burns, doesn't it? I loves her and she just got him a picture frame. I bought my son a MacBook, a new iPhone, and some AirPods and he hates me. What did I do wrong? Well, that was hilarious. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And make sure you subscribe to our man's channel in the description below. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh! I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.